In a stunning turn of events, famed comedian Paulie Shaw and the Comedy Store find themselves embroiled in a serious lawsuit. Now this isn't your everyday tabloid fodder. We're talking about a lawsuit filed by Sean Kehoe and his daughter Kira Lynn Potts. And boy do they have a tale to tell. Picture this. Kehoe, enjoying a night at the Comedy Store, when out of nowhere he's violently attacked by the club's security. Sounds like a nightmare, doesn't it? But wait, there's more. Allegedly, Shaw himself knew about the assault, and hold your breath, even encouraged it. As a result, Kehoe didn't just walk away with a couple of bruises. No, he suffered severe injuries and emotional distress. But the trauma wasn't just his alone. His daughter Potts was there, and she too experienced emotional distress witnessing the attack. The allegations have sent ripples through the comedy world, casting a shadow over Shaw's reputation and the comedy store's legacy. This, ladies and gentlemen, is just the beginning of a saga that promises to be as shocking as it is intriguing. The Comedy Store, an iconic venue on LA's Sunset Strip, is no stranger to controversy. Born in the vibrant year of 1972, the brainchild of Paulie Shaw's parents, this comedy club has been a cornerstone of Los Angeles' entertainment scene. Over the years, it has seen a parade of comedy giants grace its stages, each leaving behind a legacy of laughter and charm. Yet, it hasn't always been smooth sailing. The Comedy Store has had its fair share of controversies, but none as grave as the current predicament. The accusations now faced by this institution are severe. Negligence in hiring unfit security personnel is not a charge to be taken lightly. The claim that they failed to intervene during a violent assault adds a darker shade to the picture. This isn't just about a single incident, but a question of the club's commitment to the safety and well-being of its patrons. The Comedy Store, once a beacon of laughter and joy, now faces a grim reality. The lawsuit against Paulie Shaw and the Comedy Store could have far-reaching implications. This isn't just about an isolated incident, but a potential black mark on the illustrious careers of both Shaw and the iconic comedy venue. If found guilty, Shaw could face a significant blow to his reputation. This could lead to a drop in his popularity, impacting his future gigs and overall career. As for the Comedy Store, a guilty verdict could tarnish its image, which has been built over more than five decades. A possible consequence could be a decrease in patronage, affecting the club's bottom line. Moreover, the damages sought by Sean Kehoe and Kira Lynn Potts are not to be taken lightly. These include wage loss and medical expenses, both of which could add up to a substantial amount. The legal repercussions for Shaw and the club might also include hefty fines and possible sanctions. As we await the court's decision, one thing is clear, this lawsuit could change the face of comedy as we know it.